All oh, right, I need to fold it too. You can narrate this video. What are you doing here, Francis? Uh, okay. We just opened up the mouse, and it's got this little mousey thing that it feels like something's moving around when you rub it. Kind of like uh, bad sex joke, but it only works when you fold the mouse up. So you fold it. And now it's got a little blue thing down there and a red light inside. What about now, the little the actuator thing? Now there's thing a little tiny bar in there. Oh, yeah, you can see it? Focus there. Little bar. Yeah, what do we think the bar does? Um, creates magic. Somehow mm -hmm. vibrates the touch part, so it feels like it's actually clicking or scrolling. It's yeah. pretty neat. Chester thought it was a, a little speaker in there that was making a vibrating sound. And Piezo, I thought... A piezoelectric speaker. Okay. And One of you, those. What did you think it was? I thought it was... What did I think it was again? Oh. A little, um, stepping motor. Because it has this feature where it, like, slows down every once in a while. I think it's digitally... Yeah. Digitally. It, it appears that it's... It's not actually... Nothing actually moves, though. Oh, you... and it... I don't see how... It could be something moving in there. Because it's, it's, it's so long. Why is it so long? So that's long? the touchpad section, that, that silver part there. It's, and then underneath. The feeling is meant to simulate the feeling of a, a mouse wheel scrolling. Yeah. And what this little component does. Un though. Underneath is that little silver bar thing that must be the actuator, I'm guessing. We're going to investigate.